The following video will cover initial installation and commission of the Obvious Data Acquisition Server. We will be using the Obvious A8810 Embedded Aqua Suite as a demonstration. The Aqua Suite acts as a foundation to allow users to easily monitor and measure various energy meters and sensors. The following items will be required for installing and commissioning an Aqua Suite. You will need an Ethernet cable, 24 volt power supply for powering the device, and a flathead screwdriver. The default AquaSuite setting has DHCP enabled, allowing the AquaSuite to automatically search for an IP address once power has been provided. Connect the power to the AquaSuite and the following error message will appear on the LCD screen. There are two options to choose from when installing an AquaSuite server, accessing the AquaSuite through a laptop or accessing the AquaSuite through a local area connection. If using the AquaSuite with a laptop, connect the Ethernet cable to the RJ45 port of the laptop and the Ethernet port on the bottom of the AquaSuite board. Once connected, the AquaSuite will attempt to attain an IP address from the laptop using AutoIP. Note, if using an operating system that doesn't support AutoIP, Windows XP, or an older version of Microsoft operating system, please visit www.obvious.com products A8812 and see the video titled AquaSuite Legacy Installation or contact Obvious Technical Support for assistance configuring your device. Once the AquaSuite LCD shows the following message, users can use any browser to access the AquaSuite. The following example will use Chrome. Open the internet browser of your choice. Enter the IP address from the LCD screen and into the URL bar on your browser and hit enter. The alternative way to access an Aqua Suite is through a local area connection. This step requires a computer with access to the local area network. You will first need to identify the serial number of the Aqua Suite by the sticker on the back of the device. Connect one end of the Ethernet cable to an active LAN port and the other to the Ethernet port on the bottom of the Aqua Suite board. When the LCD displays Aqua Suite ready, access the LAN network by clicking on the network icon on the desktop. Once open, scroll down to the other devices and select the device that matches the serial number on the back of the AquaSuite. This will automatically open a browser to an AquaSuite via the LAN connection. At this point, whether using option 1 or 2, once connectivity with an AquaSuite has been established, you'll be prompted to enter your login and password. The default login and password is admin. The next step is to begin adding Modbus devices to the AquaSuite. Click on the device list. The following screen will show devices that have been connected to an AquaSuite. In this example, an obvious Flex IO module has been added to an AquaSuite. For the AquaSuite unit to begin logging data, you must name all the connected devices. To do so, click on the listed device and provide a unique name for the particular meter or sensor. You have now installed your AquaSuite server and are logging data from your connected devices. This now concludes the installation and commission of your AquaSuite. As we continue this series, we will explore incorporating multiple Modbus devices onto a single network, the introduction of the AquaSuite Plus with built-in meter functionality and the AquaSuite system as a whole. Thank you for your interest in Obvious Hardware. For any questions or inquiries, please contact Obvious Sales.